A new attitude is the new attitude. I grass. I grass balls. Last Sunday, on occasion of Easter, two precious notebooks of naturalist Charles Darwin were found. During his research on the theory of evolution in the Galapagos Islands in the 19th century, Darwin jotted his observation in his diaries. He took about 20 years to transform these observations into the most notable scientific theory in his book on the origin of species, released in 1959. Thus, the diaries played an important role in understanding the development of his ideas. Two of these diaries went missing from the Cambridge University Library in 2001. In 2020, the library revived efforts to locate them. A case of theft was registered and help sought from people across the globe. The two diaries reappeared as mysteriously as they had vanished. In a pink bag with a note to the librarian stating, Librarian, Happy Easter, X. Now, this merits a whodunit text, isn't it? I graspers, did you know that Srinagar Kashmir is home to Asia's largest tulip garden? Known as the Indira Gandhi Memorial Tulip Garden, the space is spread across 74 acres of land in the foothills of the suburban mountain range in Kashmir and overlooks the Dal Lake. The garden was first opened in 2007 and about 1.5 million multicolored tulip bulbs were brought in from the Kokken of Tulip Garden of Amsterdam in Netherlands. Each year, the Tulip Festival is celebrated in the spring season, opening the garden to the public in an effort to boost tourism in the region. This year, the festival has started from March 23rd and has already registered 3.5 lakh visitors. Unfortunately, the temperature rise has led to early wilting of flowers, thus forcing the authorities to close the garden for the public early this year from April 18th. While the colorful blooms cheer our mood, news of global warming impacting every aspect of life does cause concern. Hope you pledge to do your bit to save Mother Earth this Earth Day. A bizarre portal with a spinning vortex effect has opened up in a lake in the United States once again. The opening of this giant 72 feet wide hole took place after water levels got too high in Lake Berryessa, California. Did you know that this vortex is the result of a man-made structure created by engineers in the 1950s? It functions as a drain hole, swallowing around 1,360 cubic meters of water per second whenever the lake rises above 4.7 meters, thus creating the spinning vortex effect. Isn't that fascinating, eye graspers? The word of the week is dazzle, which means to shine brilliantly or impress. During the extravaganza, Shaurya's singing dazzled everyone. The riddle of the week is, what rock group consists of four famous men, but none of them sing? The faces on Mount Rushmore in America. Can you guess who? This German inventor was the son of a goldsmith and spent most of his life in Germany. He discovered the concept of a movable type of metal that could print ink onto paper quickly as compared to the previously used wood blocks. This discovery helped him to invent the world's first printing press, which allowed the printing of thousands of books at once. This was a tough one. So very good if you got it. It is Johannes Gutenberg. Did you know that without the printing press, it would have been impossible to have the scientific revolution and renaissance period? Did you know that bowling was first played by the ancient Egyptians? It involved throwing stone balls in a narrow 4 meter long lane in an attempt to roll the ball into a square opening at the center of the lane. Findings in Nagada, Egypt in 1895 consisting of porphyry stones and nine vase-shaped figures indicate the invention of bowling in Egypt. Quiz time! Which country is known for having the largest bowling alley in the world? Send your answers to contact us 
at iGraph.com along with your full name, full name and a photograph. Answer to the last week's quiz. Walter Winans was the first person to win Olympic medals in both arts and sports, in sculpture and shooting respectively. This certificate of appreciation is presented to Avneet Kaur of Wisdom World School, Kurukshetra, for successfully participating in the weekly quiz on India's leading news capsule for tweens, iGrasp. Dear iGraspers, this week, let us go back in history to the aftermath of the Second World War with party shoes. Meet Selena as she receives a parcel from her godmother in America. Amidst the excitement, she is delighted to find a beautiful party dress and a pair of party shoes. But delight soon turns to dismay as she realizes that she may never have an occasion to wear these clothes during the war. That is until she comes up with an idea to organize a pageant with her cousin. Will she be successful? To find out more, read this book and don't forget to share your thoughts at igrasp.com forward slash iclub. Igrasp, making kids future ready.